What's up guys, it's Randy, and my last series review I did was The Insidious. Sorry, I haven't done any series review for quite a while, in forever, but here I go, Halloween. John Carpenter's Halloween. This film was great. This has done excellently, done super well. So, when I was about younger, I got always scared of the theme, and the guy, Michael Myers scary but but I became to like him so yep Michael Myers uh, great than other horror flicks but I do like them all Halloween 2 this film follows right after the first movie so yep <coughs> my bad excuse me but and we got Halloween 3 which this film has nothing to do with the Michael Myers films. It just has, it's just that it, it has nothing with it. So, yep. And then we got Halloween 4, Return of Michael Myers, which this film takes place a decade after Michael's been dead. So, so he's been dead over for a decade and now he's back. So, yep. And in real life, he has a nine-year-old niece that Jamie Lee Curtis has a nine-year-old daughter. So, yep. Then we got my favorite, Halloween 5. Halloween 5, basically, it's my favorite of the series. But it was pretty good. Then we got a triple feature uh, pack of... It includes three films by Dimension Films. We got Chris Michael Myers... H2O and Resurrection. So, Resur um, Chris Michael Myers was okay, but it's just that it just has this weird, strange ending. So, I might probably get the producer's cut of it, but who knows? H2O. This film takes place about two decades after the first film. Well, it kind of it's just that it takes place that Jamie Lee Curtis as Laurie Strode has a son. So, yep. Oh, and Resurrection. That, that's the final film in the original franchise. And then we got Rob Zombie's Halloween. This is the theatrical cut. So, the actual cut was okay. But then I got the director's cut. Which I'll say that I like the director's cut more than the theatrical cut. But, but still, pretty good remake. And then we got Rob Zombie's Halloween 2. And... Rob Zombie's Halloween 2? Well, worse than, than ever of the Halloween franchise. Well, and that's the Halloween series. So stay tuned for my next series review, and I'll see you guys later.